Hello, beauty enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the world of natural hair care, exploring a unique ingredient that's been a game changer for many lanolin. Stay tuned as we uncover the secrets of using lanolin for luscious locks. Lanolin is a wax that is produced by the sebaceous glands of sheep, containing fatty acids and wax ester. This substance protects the sheep by making its wool essentially water. Due to these excellent moisture retention properties, you can also use lanolin for hair. It comes in a variety of hair products, including shampoo, conditioner, tonic, and pomade. There are lots of benefits for using lanolin on your hair. It readily penetrates the shaft of the hair, helping it to retain moisture and protecting it against breakage. Once it has been absorbed by the hair, lanolin works as a humac continuing to draw in moisture from the air. Not only good for the shaft of the hair, the wax is also good for the scalp and may help minimize dandruff and itching. This product is especially good for very curly hair, helping to control frizz and bringing definition to the curls. Using lanolin for hair can also have its downside, however. It can be quite heavy and weigh down fine and thin hair, making it appear greasy over time. You should also not use lanolin if you have a wool allergy, as it may cause you to have an allergic reaction. Reactions may also be caused by the chemical used to remove bacteria from the wool. The wax is processed before being added to beauty products, but some products may have had more processing than others. Finally, Products that heavily feature lanolin can often have a rather pungent smell, though some people find this appealing. You can use lanolin on your hair in shampoo form. The amount of lanolin in shampoos tends to be small, so there is little worry about it making your hair greasy. These shampoos are used in the same way as the majority of shampoos. You apply the product to your hair, massage it into the hair and scalp, and rinse. With shampoos containing lanolin, it is best to use a small amount until you know how much is right and to rinse the Lanolin containing conditioners are also available. Like the shampoo, they often contain only small amount. You use this product in the same way as other conditioners in that you apply it to the hair, leave it in for several minutes, and then rinse. A break should be taken from this type of conditioner occasionally to avoid buildup of the wax, and you may even want to use a clarifying shampoo sometime. You can also purchase tonics that contain lanolin for hair. To use these products, you should apply two to three drops and massage it throughout the length of your hair. Avoid the scalp. These tonics can help give your hair a glossy shine. Finally, you can use lanolin for hair in the form of pomade, sometimes referred to as conditioner. You should use this product sparingly at first to avoid hair becoming over greasy. Simply massage it into the hair and scalp and then style accordingly. Good for slicker styles. You may need to use a clarifying shampoo to remove all the product from your hair. 